Nine famous people who lost their teeth. 1. Mike Tyson. The boxer has had several dental makeovers. He lost some teeth as the result of his boxing career. He had them replaced with dental implants. Tyson has had his teeth whitened as well. He's also had veneers for a more pleasing smile. 2. Steven Tyler. The singer lost his teeth while touring with Aerosmith. He got severe food poisoning in South America. He passed out in the bathroom of his hotel room. Tyler's front teeth were knocked out. He immediately had them replaced with dental implants. He was back on stage the next day. 3. Demi Moore. The actress revealed her two front teeth broke off. She believes it was due to stress. Chronic stress can trigger clenching and grinding. This causes damage to teeth and gums. Moore explained the accident. I literally knocked it out. It was almost like it fell out, and my warranty was up. Her three daughters were amused. My children love seeing me without my teeth because they think it makes me look more vulnerable and more human. She even showed photos of her toothless smile. The actress has since had her teeth repaired. Thank God for modern dentistry. She said. 4. Christy Brinkley. The model survived a helicopter crash some years ago. She injured her wrist and broke two of her molars. She had her broken teeth replaced with implants. Brinkley is very pleased with the result. 5. Whitney Houston. The singer was missing 11 teeth at the time of her death. It was revealed in her autopsy report. Houston died in 2012 from accidental drowning. She was missing most of her eyebrows as well. She also wore a wig, yet underneath it, her hair was full, black and wavy, with no balding. 6. Amy Winehouse. She lost her teeth due to her excessive drug use. Snorting cocaine affects the cartilage and the collagen around the nose. It can make gums recede. Winehouse had one front tooth missing. Another gap was in the back, which was less visible. A source close to her said, Amy is very upset about her teeth because they have literally been falling out. Her mouth is full of holes and she is desperately worried she is going to lose more. She has actually pulled a tooth out herself, which is absolutely disgusting. Winehouse died in 2011 at 27. 7. Clark Gable. Even the king of Hollywood needed dentures. He had severe periodontitis. Gable had all of his teeth removed in his early 30s. He also suffered from chronic halitosis. 8. Winston Churchill. The British Prime Minister wore dentures. He even had them modified to preserve his signature lisp. He wanted his voice to remain instantly recognizable. It was important for wartime radio broadcasts. When Churchill's dentist was drafted, he wouldn't let him go. Moreover, he ripped up the orders. Churchill felt his dentist could better serve the army by maintaining his dentures. They were sold for nearly $24,000 in 2010. 9. George Washington. The first U.S. president had lifelong teeth troubles. He wore a full set of dentures by the age of 57. It's a myth that they were made of wood though. In fact, Washington had multiple sets of dentures. They were made of human teeth, ivory, and various alloys. His dentist possibly even used cow and horse teeth.